is so senseless. What's going on in this city? They want to blame the mayor. They want to blame the NOPD. Let's just blame their home. Let's blame the parents. They have no morals. Well, family members of a beloved Brothers Food Mart worker talked to WDSU today after he was shot and killed. Witnesses who saw the shooting last week on I-10 Service Road in Crowder say it started with the man giving a kind compliment to a kid at a barber shop. WDS reporter Shay O'Connor has a story you'll see only on 6. Stella witnesses tell me it all started when victim Kenneth Smith called a kid a king at a barber shop along Crowder Boulevard. Apparently the kid's dad didn't like it. 56 year old Kenneth Smith's family still shocked one week later. He gave a kid a compliment, a kid a compliment in a barber and a man got upset. I don't know if they ever got a compliment again. He apologized three times. That compliment last Friday led to an argument. Smith apologized and left the shop. WDSU obtaining this exclusive video showing some of Smith's last moments inside a nearby business before the incident happened. About 30 minutes later, we see him walking down Crowder Boulevard. NOPD says the suspect, Harold Brooks, is the man he had just had a disagreement with at the barbershop. Witnesses say Brooks fired shots, killing Smith. It's not a person who is, you have to kill him about what he, whatever he's going to say. Those who knew Smith say he was always paying compliments to people in the area, including at this brother's food mart where he worked. Mohammed Ayash says workers will miss Smith's positivity most. Well, he was a very nice guy. And um, he always blessing everybody. They come to the stores. He was a very good person. And his NOPD continues to comb through details of just what happened that fateful day. Those who knew and loved Smith most say his goodness will never be forgotten. But it's just the fact that you took away somebody so, so, so good. So what? Because you are horrible. You are horrible individual. Now back to the man arrested for the crime. I'm told NOPD actually arrested 37-year-old Harold Brooks on Tuesday on second-degree murder charges. If you know any additional information on the situation, you're being urged to contact Crime Stoppers at 822-1111. Reporting live from NOPD headquarters, Shay O'Connor, WDSU News.